Our following developing news this morning, Chicago police are questioning a person of interest in Monday's murder of a high-profile judge. CBS 2's Mike Puccinelli is live at Area South Police Headquarters where detectives do have a person in custody. Good morning. That's right, and they've been questioning that person of interest here at Area South for hours now. That, as detectives say, they continue to pursue multiple promising leads in this case. Judge Raymond Miles was gunned down outside his south side home before dawn Monday at just around 5 o'clock in the morning. Now, he was coming to the aid of his companion who'd been shot in her leg. Witnesses reported hearing her scream, don't kill him, don't kill him, before the gunman opened fire on the 66-year-old judge. Alderman Anthony Beal represents the ward where the murder happened. He says he's confident the public isn't in any danger. I've been talking with the police, uh, talking with you know, a few, few people in the community, and I just don't believe that this was a, um, a, a random act of violence. Now, sources say the judge's companion had a restraining order out against her ex-boyfriend, but it is not clear at this time as to whether she can identify anyone that the police are interviewing at this hour. Now, the FBI has put out a $25,000 reward for anyone with information leading to an arrest in this case. Reporting live outside Area South Police Headquarters, Mike Puccinelli, CBS 2 News. Aaron, Lionel? Yeah, so many questions in this case. Mike, thank you.